guys i'm going to make barra today i have the dal in here look i'm going to grind and i'm going to start with the dal and i'll mix the other ingredients i have some cilantro some mint some parsley some garlic onion i'll put it all in there to grind and here i have my turmeric i have some baking powder i have yeast to go in there I have flour and I have some tamarind to make some tamarind chutney for that. So let's get cracking on this here. So I'll go in here, split peas, I'm going to close that and put it to blend it up. so hard to clean the bananas. I'm gonna put the the seasoning. I make special seasoning for this, so I gotta grind it separate. So I have my cilantro here, my mint and parsley, my garlic, my onion, everything going in. See, dry thyme in there. Parsley. See, this is time here. Yeah. I give that a blend up there. good with no chutney so I can eat it I don't like the chutney okay. okay guys here we go I'm going to get the the bara mix now so I have the dal and the seasoning in here see Dal and seasoning. Now I'm gonna put some Thai turmeric in there. You know what? First I'll go with flour. Let's see. From one pong, only two pong of flour in there. I don't want the barra to be very liquid. Because my liquid it take up more oil. So I'm gonna beat that good with my hand. Here I have it. I'm gonna put uh, turmeric for the color. 
one spoon that is while I'm cooking I like to clean at the same time I'll put some baking powder in there maybe one two teaspoon I have some water here I'm gonna soak the yeast in there for a bit and I will go with a two teaspoon one two teaspoon of yeast Let us melt the yeast in here. And you can put anything you want in bar, guys. Every time I make it, it's different. Because sometimes I put spinach in there. So here we go. We're throwing in the yeast in here. And now it's time to mix it up. No salt. Let's see how much salt I'll put in there. Maybe one and a half teaspoon salt. I will taste it when I finish. So now, time to get a hand messy to get in there and mix it. Hey guys, look. Look at this. See? That's the mixture for Barra. I need a big man. Muscle to do that. the bar to go fry in look we have the oil heating up there I have the bar here fries look at that time to go fry it now here I'm going to put it in to fry I'm going to use my fingers because it's sticking to the other stuff and with that this is trial All different shapes can happen here. Hey, who cares? I gotta eat. but it's okay. I don't have helpers. 
my helpers at work. It looks so yummy there. yummy with the chutney. I don't like it with the chutney. For me, I like it just like that. myself. That's so how my grandma used to make it. That's how I did it on my own. Sometimes when I make it, not all the time it rice, but that's okay. Fry it soft. Feel it all green in there. have nice garlic too. The taste of it. Yummy. Guys, look at the bar of frying. Almost finished frying it. So yummy, yummy, yummy. I've been eating it since I fry it. I have to stop. Nobody else will get any. <laughs> I don't make it every all the time, that's why, you know. That's it. I'll finish going in in there. Christmas coming, maybe I'll bake uh, fruit cake. Maybe. I'm not sure yet. My husband have to help me. <laughs> I 
I'm avoiding from the oil to pitch in the burner there. I don't like that. I'll turn the stove off now, guys. There. Woo! I think I gotta play around with that burner again because I shift it and the heat is not coming out properly. There. And with that oil cola. All the goodies are here. Look at this. The barra. That's the barra I made today. And it's so soft. Look. See? Guys, I'd like to say thank you all for watching and subscribe to my video. Liking my video and sharing it. And keep watching because I'll bring more. I had so much fun with you guys to cook all these things in the kitchen and for you guys to watch me doing it. Once again, thank you and keep subscribing. I'll bring you more recipe. Bye for now.